the last video, I talked about how I used nothing but clamp lights to light all my photography and videos for over 10 years. Now, I'm not making this video to tell you to use clamp lights. I mean, you can if you want to. I'm lighting this scene right now with nothing but clamp lights. I have blue gels over the lights lighting up the background. And for my face, I just have one clamp light with some foil on it, which I manipulated to create just a little slash of light like I have right now to give you that uneasy feeling, that creative Hollywood lighting that gives it that je ne sais quoi that you might have, would you say, in movies, yes. Anyway, so yeah, there's so many ways you can manipulate the light. For example, you can take this wrap off and just have a bare light. Now that's really bright. That's just too bright. So normally somebody would say, well, put a dimmer on it. But the Marcus way of dimming a light is I just move the light further back. <laughs> I mean, how difficult is that? Lighting videos and photography is not that difficult. People make it more difficult. They think they have to use expensive equipment. You really don't. Look at all the ways you can use this. You can just moving the light in a different position. And this is really dramatic. So now we have one clamp light going through a diffusion here in the foreground. You can use a bed sheet or plastic tarp or anything. I am using nothing but clamp lights to light up this scene. That's all I'm using. I'm not changing the type of light, just where the light is and how much of it hits you using things like tin foil. And you can use anything, anything. Just be creative with what you have. Let me show you a bunch of shots that I've done with nothing but $7 clamp lights from Home Depot. Finish them off. What if it is real? What if we can live forever? Would we be happy? We found something in the ice. Marty, get out of there now! Open the hatches. We need to launch now. My daughter's on that ship out there! You're the best there is. These $7 clamp lights were used to pitch movie ideas to Hollywood companies. I was just being creative with what I had. You can get any kind of lighting you want using clamp lights. Here you can see in the behind the scenes shots, I clamped several of them to a post. If I wanted a brighter light, I just clamped more lights onto the post. <laughs> Plus the bigger surface area of light, the softer the light gets. I found that the clamps clamp best to square or rectangular things like one by twos or two by fours or even square aluminum rods. I used it as the hair light, the main light, the side light, the fill light. They were all clamp lights and it worked out pretty good. I use these things for so many things. I use them for still photography. You can get good lighting with just about anything. People think they need expensive gear to make cool looking stuff. You don't. I mean, this is as cheap as it gets. These are seven bucks at Home Depot. I just have normal light bulb in there. You can clamp them to anything, they work great. And you can screw anything into this. Normal light bulbs, or LED cob lights. It's very versatile. It's amazing how something so simple, inexpensive, friendly, and easy to use can create such professional results. So, I hope this inspired you in some way. Maybe gave you some ideas and enlightened, eh, enlightened, I'm so... Anyway, I'll see you next week with more exciting fun things that have to do with photography. Until then, have a great week.